Alrighty then. So, Andrew was trying to decide which way to go. Yeah, I'm gonna take the left just past. Yeah. Uh, turn turn right here real quick. Oh, it Open doesn't this, matter. Yeah. Liter yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Fuck you too. All that That's suspense. Software. Our viewers have been waiting a day, a whole day, to, to see what path you would take and where it would lead you to, but it only led you to hatred. Are they hurting each other? Yep. It Un probably stopped. Okay. No, 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 no. Yeah, one of them's dead now. <laughs> so let me tell you something. I like that door squeaky sound. You can... I can basically get through the entire game with, like, just the shotgun. Yeah. Like... I mean, I... It's super efficient. I was about to say, it's really great. Also, it's not a video game shotgun where it becomes useless beyond a few feet. It, like, yeah, the, I've noticed the that. The spread just kind of stops. You told me that point. You told me that was the case, so I've been using it accordingly. Basically, yeah. I mean, clearly there's going to be bits where you're going to be like, I want this other thing. I did it. It's got like a kind of map like thing, but kind of like in Castlevania, you don't really pay attention to where it's showing yes. you where you're going. You're just like, give me the next level. Hey, you only finished that in 12 minutes when the par is a minute 15 seconds. Oh. Good. Oh. It's fine. Everyone slow their first time on Doom because <clears throat> they don't want to finish too fast. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, play the fucking level. Toxin I am here. <clears throat> what is this? A mall map? <laughs> yeah. It's a mall map, but of hell. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> did it work? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's did got it, a little thing. Did it do? Did, did Doom do? <laughs> Down to Papa! <laughs> uh, that's a new enemy. I noticed. That's also Oh, a there's enemy. an invisible one! He's really fucking Oh me up. shit! What just happened? <laughs> fucking zombie man blew himself up on that explosive barrel. Nice. <laughs> oh. Oh. Thanks, health pack. <clears throat> oh. Thanks, Nintendo. Oh, fuck you, green hair. Yeah. Apologies to all green hairs. Yeah, I like Briar. May you. Uh, but not anymore. Yeah, not anymore. She's dead now. <laughs> 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 like that night she died that one time. Oh, yeah, I remember that. Yeah. Briar's her cat, by the way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Our uh, green... Uh, Formerly green. Our green... Deceased twice cat. Our, uh, <sighs> I'm trying to come up with a fake cat breed name, but... Uh... I mean, that's not... Oh, that's a big dude, isn't it? The big dude? That guy, the, yeah, him. He's like bald and slightly taller than the other humans. Yeah, the, the baldens are. They have the shotguns. Oh, okay. There's other big dudes, but they're not in this one. They're in later games. Oh. <laughs> Man. So yeah. It's, it's riveting commentary. Yep. You're just fucking focused. You're just staring at the I screen. I know. Like, mm. uh, this is... <clears throat> I mean, I'm enjoying it a lot. <laughs> yep. That, and I know, like, in my mind that I put it on a harder difficulty, so I'm, like, take, take into it. Take it down. <laughs> take it easy, baby. Yeah, take no, the ability to save anywhere is great because lots of levels, specifically mods, because some mod are just kind of Is there an exploding barrel so I can just take care of these guys there at once? There is down there, but I don't think your auto-aim will hit it from up there. But, um, some levels are just like, you'll do fine, then you'll walk into a room, and then just like, you'll have 100% health, 100% armor, and then yeah. like, you'll just see it just drain. <laughs> you're like, fuck. <clears throat> okay. Well, that was, you already killed them all. Yeah, I know, I just... It's like that bit in Half-Life you know, 2. Oh! They... What the fuck are you? That is a soul sphere. Okay, I guess it's not meant to be shot. Yeah, it's a power-up. Oh! Yep. Okay. There's some cool power-ups in this game. You're a cool <clears throat> power-up. I'm sorry. <coughs> so... 
This is a carryover from the way I play Halo. Yeah. Is I tend, or just any shooter really, I tend to rely on my shittiest weapon a lot. Okay. So I can save my, the beautiful shotgun for when I really need it. That's what I did in, I did that in Fallout 3 and New Vegas a lot because yeah. ammo is so scarce, at least well, in, when you're low, like, lower level. Your pistols in those games are pretty fucking useful. Especially with vets. Now, Red Man has me a little worried. That? He, oh, he is a frisky see, his motherfucker. Official, his official name is Demon. <laughs> it's kind of weird because they're all demons. But oh. uh, he's received the name. Oh, yeah, Tom! <laughs> but he's received the nickname Pinky by fans because. <laughs> That's yeah. Cute. Now be careful here. You don't want to fall into the slime. Or poison, as it just straight up says. <clears throat> In this donut of death, you're on here. <laughs> hey. Hey. More like Donut of Doom, am Doi! I right? <laughs> ah! This is gonna end well. This, this is gonna end super well. No! No. Andrew was killed. Oh. When did you last save? Uh, like the beginning. Ah, shit. Well, there you fucking go. That's like half the episode. Hot um, name. Oh, oh well. well. <laughs> You know what, I'm not gonna yeah, make the yeah. same mistake. The, ch the chainsaw is cool, but it's best when it's like, hey, look at this enemy, this lone enemy that I could just not waste my ammo on. It's incredibly useful for uh, times when you see an enemy, because like when you hit, basically, basically when you hit them, they can't attack you. Where'd you go? There you are. Come on, Shadow the Hedgehog, bring it! So, fun fact about the chainsaw, it does the same amount of damage as your standard punch, but like a hundred times as fast. Oh, okay, that's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. You're cool. Also, the way, uh, because monsters can- Hey! Monsters can- Who hear. shot- the, who- who did that? Monsters can hear in the <laughs> game. <laughs> Apparently you can, too. Monsters can hear in this game, and, um, the thing is, the revving of the chainsaw doesn't make an in-game sound, but just you punching and not hitting anything does make a sound. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like, you can, like- because you can like walk into a room full of monsters and yeah. probably facing away from you and you'll pull out your chainsaw and just sit there and nothing will happen and you'll punch there and they'll be like, the fuck was that? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <clears throat> Must have just been the wind. Huh? What was that noise? Has arrows sticking out of my eye. I know, right? God. No, I would, I would have like times in like Metal Gear Solid games when I would straight oh, up. Oh, I need a key to open the... When I would straight up fucking shoot some dude. I would shoot a guy standing next to his buddy yeah. and his fucking brains would splatter out and the guy <laughs> would turn to his bloody corpse with half a head and say, What's wrong? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you splotered them. That was satisfying. Hey, fuck you, buddy. You splotered them real good. Hey. Uh... <laughs> I, just, I just like how it repeatedly plays the, <laughs> the pain sound. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> uh, I like how his shotgun just erupted out of the room. <laughs> uh. <clears throat> you know, that's something I really like is when in game weapons. Are just floating, spinning in yes. the air. I just there's something about that. I just kind of like this is a video game. I really want that to happen in like a movie, where like, but it's like a hist, like it's a period piece, and like British World War One soldier drops rifle after being shot, and it just rotates in midair. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Also, that you just pick up a health pack and as soon as you touch it, you're healed. Yeah. It's perfect. Come on. Come on, dick mate. <clears throat> I like when games have, like, weird, nonsensical sort of healing systems, but then their, like, their successors try to make sense out of it. Yeah. Like, in Resident Evil, you use herbs to heal, and I think it was in the fifth one where you actually see that you put it into a capsule and you spray it onto your wounds. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, I didn't see and that And then in the before. sixth one, you like pop them like pills. It's kind of weird, you'll be in the middle Come of battle. Back. I want the ermine. You, you'll be in the middle of battle and you'll Woo. run around and then you'll just hit the heel. Oh, my fucking dicks on a Sunday morning. Oh boy. Oh, that was a guy up there. <sighs> and I auto-aimed his dick. Yeah. But no, in the sixth Resident Evil, you pop them like pills, so you'll just be in the middle of combat and you'll be like, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Come on, come on. Gotta have my fix, man. Gotta get my herb. Gotta get my fix of uh, vitamin gummies. Shit. <laughs> uh, man. 
That's a, that's a thing we made one time. Yep. I was I participated in that. So because it's like one of those things where it's like I don't really like it that much, and I don't have it. It was shot of... prettily. Yeah. Not edited that great. Fucking. Still, <laughs> let's not name drop. <laughs> I'm just like fucking <laughs> guy, guy man, Jimmy Editsman. <laughs> Editsman. Fucking Adobe Premiere guy. <laughs> um, but no, like. Basically, it was a short film I did for like my first project in a class that just basically just showed that we had basic f filming and editing skills. Mm -hmm. Where because uh, wasn't it for a post production post yeah. and you were doing color correcting? Yeah, that was the basic deal. Is make sure you color correct it. But um, oh, the basic oh, oh look at Pepto Bismol over there. <laughs> the basic <laughs> freak of the fuck it. out. Oh, he brought friends. The basic gist of it is that um, Andrew has a crippling addiction to multivitamin gummies. Yep. <laughs> so his friends walk in, he's got a fucking mouthful of them. <laughs> They're actually gummy bears, but he's like, it's not what it looks like. And then his friends try to stop him, and then he just fucking downs the whole bottle and dies. Yep. It was really dumb. It was great. It was... I had a lot of fun. I, could, I liked how I couldn't think of an ending line, so you came up with a few. I just, like, spouted out a bunch of one-liners. Oh, there's a sweet down there. Looks like I took too much vitamin death. <laughs> Looks like the vitamin end of me. <laughs> I got goofed! Yeah, that was my favorite. Uh, I forget which Isn't one I used. Isn't that the one we went with? I think was I used like vitamin. Oh, I thought we went with Because I think gum goofed just kind of came right. off as really goofy. <laughs> you fucker. Mm. Alright, uh, well, you should probably save because you fucking died at this part. Yeah, I sure did, Jibby. Jibby. Beef truncheon. Beef truncheon. Thank you, Andrew Hussey. For incorporating that phrase, that uh, term, into my personal lexicon. Tits America. You beautiful fucko, you. Ah, you kind of you did the thing. Oh, oh fuck you! Oh, your shotgun fuck blasts you, were, were sort of synced up, so it was kind of like <laughs> kablamo. We still need to do that mod where you, just replace, where you replace all the sounds of this game with just generic kablam. Yep actually possible and I love that we can do it. We could like release it and our fans, all yeah. four of them would be like, oh yeah. <laughs> I thought we only had three. Oh, I think we have four now. Oh, amazing. <sighs> Shit, yeah. And the lights went out. Yep. Not that it made much of a difference. Yeah, I might. I might hey, Jimmy Throbble. Hey, come on. Come get it. Come get it. Come get the turkey on Christmas morning. Oh, that it didn't work. Okay. Hey, how about you? Come on. Come get some seconds. Ow, fuck you, man. Fuck you. <clears throat> I think he might have actually. Football! I think he might have actually died before the barrel exploded. Shut up. Yeah. Is that? No, that's just a little. It's a bullets. What a. You got yourself Is that a blue key. Oh, oh, I did. Yup. That's. I guess I can up. maybe go unlock that door from way earlier in the yep. level. To to totally do that. But what if it's for a different door? There's only one blue door, so yeah. Was it blue? Yeah. Oh. It looked. Gray to me. <laughs> I mean, well, I mean, you gotta look at the sides. Oh, oh, the sides. Okay. Yeah. Because I remember it just had like the same little red dippies on it. Okay, who the fuck are you? That's, who the fuck are you? That's a soul sphere. Oh, uh, you said I just. Yeah, but you died since then, so I figured I'd recap. I don't. What if every time you die, memory. we forget that every we forget everything we do? John. Yeah. That's pretty fucked. Yeah. Except that's also, that wouldn't make any sense since, like, whenever you load your save, you remember. Oh my gosh. So, like, Spyro, A Hero's Tale. Not very good. But it has one of my favorite meta jokes in a video game. Yeah. And that is, so Spyro gets captured, and um, it seems like he might be dead. Oh, fuck. And so his buddy Spark, like, one of his companions, uh finds Sparks the Dragonfly, who is, like, the living, breathing health bar. Oh, I found a yellow key. Mm -hmm. Um, and, uh, Sparks is like, How do you know he's not dead? And Guy replies, Well, if he was, we would have loaded to the previous save. Uh, <laughs> I'm a genius. Oh, yeah. Uh, it made me smile, like, not the rest of that game at all. Yeah. Uh, there were some cool parts. Cat, uh, fucking... 
Captain Bird or what? Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, that's how that works. Or Captain Penguin, whatever his name was. He yeah. was fun. That's something I both love and hate, is like when something shitty has a really good part. Yeah. What happens is you'll tell people about that good part, because you want to tell them about it, but then you have to be like, yeah, but th the rest. But then you'll have to show them the rest next time on Dorm Games. Oh.